Hey, I'm Whitney with rosegoldmama.com. And today I want to talk to you about burnout and overwhelm. Overwhelm leading to burnout, just feeling exhausted, stressed out, and then not even caring about anything, right? Just going through the motions day after day. It's something a lot of us experience. Um, you know, you just get to the point where <laughs> nothing seems to matter. You're just like, let's push this button. Let's keep the kids alive. Like we'll feed them. We'll get them to their activities. And all the joy in my life is gone. That sucks. Um, it's just not a great place to be. And I've got three tips to help you get out of that. If you start to feel overwhelmed or even worse, burnt out, then you need to reprioritize your time. Take a moment, step back, and see what it is that you're doing with your time and with your life. And understand whether or not that's really what you want to be doing with your time and your life. If it's not, readjust. Take a moment and go through everything that's going on and say, you know, this thing is not actually my priority. This thing isn't actually what I wanna be doing with my life. This thing isn't really something that is helping me to be better or help my family be better and move them all to the side. You have to reprioritize your life when you're feeling that in, in, intense like overwhelm or when you're feeling burnt out, reprioritize your life. The next is self-care. I know everyone, self-care, self-care, self-care. I'm not talking bubble baths. I am talking about taking time to care for you, to do the things that you need. When you're overwhelmed, when you're burnt out, you are probably most likely not making the time to actually be with yourself and make sure that you're okay. You need to take some time to put some joy into your life. So make that time. The last is to be present with your family and friends. Overwhelm and burnout often, you know, have these kind of reoccurring thoughts going on in your head that are keeping you away from the moment that you're in. And so one way to combat that is to say, hey, like all these thoughts, I'm gonna put them to the side, just put them over to the side and focus and be present and be in the moment with your family and your friends. It's hard. I mean, really, it's truly a challenge, but it is definitely something that is going to help you get through that overwhelm and definitely going to help you get out of that burnout. It's important that you take action to care for yourself, right? You are responsible not only for your life but for the life of your kids and you want to be the best you can be for you you want to be the best you can be for them and that means that when you find yourself feeling overwhelmed if you find yourself feeling burnt out you have to take some action to get through those thoughts because you're not living your best life right you're not loving life you're not thriving and you're not giving your gifts to the world you're not doing the most that you can for you or the most that you can for your kids when you're in that state so you got to get out of that state um, those three tips should help remember the first is to reprioritize your time, take a look at what's going on in your life and make sure that you are spending your time where you wanna be spending your life. The next is to make time for self-care, right? Take care of yourself. You are the only one who's responsible for making sure you're okay. So you have to do it, right? You just, you have to do it. You're an adult now. Um, and the last is to be present. Be present, take time to hang out with your family, to hang out with your friends and be in the moment when you're with them. Don't be off someplace worrying about things or on your phone, just be present, be in the moment and engage with them. And these three tips are gonna help you to move through your overwhelm and move through burnout. There are more tips, tricks, hacks, and ideas at my blog, rosegoldmama.com. So if you are interested in learning more self-care ideas, um, time management is a huge part of getting through overwhelm um, and beating burnout. You can head to the blog for tips on time management as well. Um, and if you like this information, please uh, subscribe, like, you know, holla at your girl. I would appreciate it. Um, seriously, slip into my DMs and let me know what else you wanna hear about and whether or not this was helpful. I want to help you like that's I think that's what I'm here for I'm here to help working moms and I um and so just let me know what you need let me know thanks again Whitney Hawthorne from Rose Gold Mama that's me